What's up guys, how's it going? Mike the Tech here and we are here with the Pole W Top. This is a very, very, extremely, extremely capable dock for your Mac Mini. Not only is this an 8-in-1 USB hub, which includes everything from a 10 gigabit per second USB-C port, a USB-A 3.2 Gen 2 port, two USB-A 2.0 ports, a 3.5 millimeter audio port, an SD card port, and a micro SD card port, uh, or slot, I should say. But it also has an M2 NVMe drive built in. So once you drop your M2, yeah, I guess I have an M2 Mac. Once you drop your Mac Mini in there, you can actually connect to the uh, NVMe solid state drive as well, which is just insane. And it supports all sizes of the solid state drives. Um, so super, super cool. Let's go ahead and open it up and see what's inside. So before we get started, I want to give a huge shout out to Geeks Outfit. Uh, they hooked me up with this t-shirt and most of the t-shirts you see on my channel. Um, if you like tech and nerdy apparel, definitely check them out in the description below. So let's go ahead and open this up and see its actual form factor. All right, very well packaged. We have a custom made uh, box here for it that keeps it nice and uh, in place, which is nice to see. We've got instructions here. That basically tells you you're going to connect the USB-C cable to your Mac Mini's Thunderbolt port. And the max speed for the 3.2 Gen 2 ports is uh, 10 gigabits per second. So, enough of the tech stuff. Let's go ahead and pull this out. We have a thermal pad here uh, for the NVMe drive. That's really cool that they actually include that. So they give you the thermal uh, pad and they give you a couple screws and a dampener to install the NVMe as well. Let's go ahead and pull the device out. Oh nice, it actually gives you a pretty long cable so you can drop something else in here, like a laptop or something, for example, and use that as well. Um, so first off, very clean looking device. Um, it has pads on the bottom so that it can stay in place and everything. Um, the NVMe drive can be installed on the bottom here. And then all of your ports, except for two, are right up here we have our peripheral ports these are basically USB A ports that are uh, 2.0 or slower speed 480 megabits per second um, we have our USB C 10 gigabit port we have our SD card slot and micro SD card slot and then we have a 10 gigabit uh, 3.2 A port as well as the 3.5 millimeter audio port right there so everything you need right there then you're going to drop your Mac Mini right in and plug this in, which I'm actually recording on the Mac Mini, so I'm going to get some B-roll footage of that to show you what that looks like. And you can even drop your phone on here. Um, you can put your phone or tablet here. It has a nice little pad. Um, lean it up against your uh, Mac, and you're good to go. You can even charge it or connect it and transfer photos or videos. Um, all that good stuff right here. On the inside, you don't have to worry about your Mac Mini getting too scratched up. As scary as metal on metal is, this does have pads on both the bottom and sides. So, yeah, you're good to go. Thank you so much for Pobble Top for sending this over. And, uh, yeah, I'm excited to try it out and put it to use. Thank you so much for watching and hope you have a good one. Peace. to games to end up used with a broader view. He keeps it fresh, always bring something new. It's Mike the Tech, Mike the Tech, huh? Mike the Tech, the architect, huh? Mike the Tech, Mike the Tech, yeah. Mike the Tech, the architect, huh?